Now at four, a man is behind bars and a woman is fighting for her life in the hospital. Police say she was stabbed multiple times. It happened at a West Valley Maverick this morning at 31st South and Redwood Road. Brittany Johnson is there with details. This Maverick is back open after it was closed temporarily due to one of the clerks being stabbed multiple times. Now police are hoping that surveillance cameras caught the attack because their suspect is not cooperating. Just after 2.30 Monday morning, West Valley police say they received a disturbance call. Witnesses reporting seeing a man screaming and hitting garbage cans. Our officers we responded and uh, luckily we're close in the area. They actually encountered a much more severe situation, however. Lieutenant Steve Katz tells me 33-year-old Edwin Agondo walked into this Maverick and stabbed the clerk at least six times. Two men saw what was going on and stepped in to intervene, possibly saving her life. We're very, very fortunate that they were here and that they were brave enough to to assist. Um, this was a very, very serious situation and she, the clerk could easily have been killed. Those good Samaritans were able to hold the suspect down until police arrived. Lieutenant Katz says Agonda was not cooperating, but they were able to arrest him without resorting to lethal means. This could easily have been a situation which could have risen to the level of uh, requiring lethal force. Um, but thanks to our to our officers and the tools that they were able to deploy, we were able to to avoid that. We deployed a pepper ball um, system, and also he was apprehended with the assistance of a police canine. Police are currently working on a possible motive. They say this definitely was not a robbery, but are trying to determine if this was a personal attack. But with a combative suspect and a victim still in the hospital, this investigation is going to take time. Reporting in West Valley City, I'm Brittany Johnson.